Hi guys, Angela here. Just wanted to do a quick unboxing. I have a new baby. <laughs> it's not a human baby. A new piece of equipment for the channel that I'm super excited about. If you watched my last video, you uh, probably heard me mention it very briefly in the end. Uh, I cut open the box, but I haven't actually gotten to see it yet. So without further ado, we have a drone and I have no experience with the drone um, I watched a ton of videos I uh, read about a dozen reviews and this is the one that I came up with it is the DJI mini 3 Pro and there's a number of reasons I went with this one um, the main reason being that as I said I am NOT a profession professional I have no experience flying a drone at all um, this one seems fairly easy but it also gives good enough quality to be semi-professional. But I also made sure to uh, get all the accessories, the extended battery, and all of the things. So if you're looking for uh, a review that's gonna tell you all the specs and all the things, this is not it. This is just simply me, a regular person, uh, opening up a drone. So here's me very professionally using a kitchen knife to open my drone. I'm a little excited. My hands are shaking. Look at how tiny this thing. It is so light. Um, I feel like if I had a giant pocket, I could fit this in my pocket. Um, one of the main reasons, again, that I went with this is because it is so small. It's an ultralight, and um, it's going to be perfect for backpacking. It's going to be unobtrusive, so I'll be able to take it into more places, I feel like, uh, without it being apparent that I'm bringing in a drone. Um, I don't plan on, you know, invading anyone's privacy, but um, I just really want this for a lot of, like, the, the scenery shots um, and get up above the tree line and things like that. So I think this is going to be perfect for me. Another decision I went with is um, to go with the RC controller so that I don't actually have to use my phone um, and drain my phone battery while I'm out in the middle of nowhere. So it was definitely more expensive to go with this option, but I think it's a much better option for me personally. Um, yeah, And this, I believe this actual controller just came out with this option. I feel very professional right now. It reminds me a lot of like a game controller, so I have a feeling I'm going to be fighting my kids for this. <laughs> Looks like it comes with a USB-C cord for charging. Um, looks like some extra propellers. And a little start guide and a little baby screwdriver. So cute. So one complaint that I did see a few of the reviews had, and it's kind of a small thing in the scheme of things, is that it only comes with the charging cord itself. It doesn't actually come with the charging block, which I also find kind of weird. You think if you're spending this much money, they would just put the actual charging block to plug it in. I'm not sure if it comes with an actual charge on it or not. Oh, it is turning on though. So we will get these all charged up. Um, I'm excited to do the first flight. It is quite windy where I'm at today, so I'm not sure if I'll get to doing it today. I may just uh, wait till tomorrow when I'm actually going on my first backpacking trip with my drone. But either way, I will uh, take you along on my first flight just so you can uh, 
see how my experience is as a person that's never ever flown a drone before and going straight to this one. Um, I'll show you some of the accessories. I also went with the Fly More kit um, for extra batteries, the case, and some other things. So since I am going to be taking my drone on trips um, and things like that where I might not have you know, uh, access to um, charging, I went with the Fly More kit. Fly More Kit Plus, which has extra batteries and things like that for a much longer flight time and I'll be able to just bring extra batteries with me. So, here's the little case I got. Um, I was reading about it, I think it's water resistant, but it doesn't look like it's actually waterproof. But it seems like a nice, well-built case. There's a pocket here. It has uh, more extra propellers. I'm seeing a theme here. <laughs> um, comes with another, oh, this one has a charging cord with a USB and more extra propellers. Do we feel like we're gonna be breaking some propellers? Um, there's a little divider thing in here, which might be nice. And... So this is the charging uh, port, or whatever you want to call it. Very, it seems very well made. And then we have the extra batteries. So these are the big guys that'll give me increased flight time. They do add a little bit more weight than already comes on it. This one does come with a smaller battery and then these are the two um, extended flight time batteries. Oh, and I also got the micro SD card. So I went with the 256 gig here, which we'll need. And I also went with a multi-pack of filters. These filters, um, I went with the Freewell All Day 6-pack which was a recommendation from somebody else um, on one of the review sites. And these filters will go right over the camera lens um, for different filters based on the daylight and things like that. Obviously, this is all gonna take a lot of research, a lot of trial and error before I figure all of this out. A little overwhelmed at the moment, but I know that it's just gonna take time to just go through all of this and see what works best and get my whole uh, rhythm down with the whole thing. Um, I'm really excited about this drone um, because we have our fall colors coming up fairly soon. I'm just noticing the leaves change. It's uh, the end of August right now and here in the UP of Michigan. Uh, fall is absolutely gorgeous and I'm really looking forward to a lot of water and color shots and things like that. So keep an eye on the channel and um, I plan on really incorporating a lot of these drone shots into my videos and I think it's going to really improve the quality of my videos overall. So thanks for watching. Again, if you're looking for all the technical specs and things side by side comparison, there's a whole lot of videos already that explain all of that. That is not going to be my thing, um, but I will probably at some point do some update videos just uh, telling what I like or don't like about this little guy. Um, if you have any questions, you can ask and I could try to answer them to the best of my abilities. Um, yeah, let's have some fun.